Yeah, prosecutors say she faces life in prison. And as some of our viewers might remember, she got caught because her husband's cell phone kept ringing through the wall. Lula Caruth will never forget this face, nor the gruesome crime surrounding Latasha Starks Twilly. She was crazy. Crazy. The 43 year old now convicted of first degree murder after prosecutors say she killed her husband, Waddell Twilly, and hid his body in the attic of their Parkway Village home on Cottonwood. I just hate it. And vividly remembers Twilly's 11 year old son running next door to her home in the summer of 2016. She was crying. Because his dad was missing, so the boy called his cell phone and heard it ringing through an upstairs wall. That's just wrong. He said, I think my mama. Uh, don't kill my daddy. Caruth called police, who found Waddell's body in a small crawl space behind a padlock door. Investigators say it was encased in concrete in a plastic tub covered with clothes, dirt, and cigarette buds. They also say his hands and feet were handcuffed, his head wrapped in plastic and duct tape. Yeah, I mean, she had to be gone. Her mind had to slip like that. Prosecutors say the cause of death was suffocation. I heard uh, through the grapevine they were finna get a divorce. Waddell Twilly was 47 and leaves behind several children. He was such a good person, you know, to me. To, to you know, he always been friendly, and always you know, talk, communicate. And so when when it happened, it's really surprised me, and I hate it for the kids because the kids just love their dad. They love their dad. Yeah, prosecutors believe Latasha may have been planning to bury her husband, but she told her kids a hole she was digging in the backyard was simply for a garden. Live downtown, Andrew Ellison, WRG News, Channel 3.